Excuse me. Stay down. Thank <laughs> you. 
We're doing this. Suspicious. Yagami. Yagami. Hmm. Say what? Here's your proof.
Say what? Yep. Hmm? Huh? <laughs> hmm? Hey. Excuse me. Check this out. Nandato Yagami. Say what? Yagami. You have a sec, Shintani-sensei? Huh? There's something I need to talk to you about. Huh. Perfect timing. I got a few words for you myself. Huh? Come on. Sounds like Hamra's not too happy... with you. Huh? He says to quit digging around. We won the case, it's done. And I gotta say, I agree with him. Or was my victory not good enough for you? Oh, your victory and yours alone, huh? <laughs> you heard me. I was the lawyer. My victory. 
And thanks to that, work's been just flooding in. It's over, Yagami. Let it die. Your work might be over, but the murderer is still out there. This mole you're dying to catch? Well, fuck right off! Your little detective game has done enough damage. Why don't you just leave this alone, huh? Hamura knows who the murderer is. He hid it from us the whole trial. And that innocent verdict made fools of us all. Maybe you're okay with that, but I'm not about to give this up. Ha! <laughs> you talk big, but you're just a mouse, and Hamura's a hungry fucking cat. Funny, he's the one in hiding. The Kyore are gunning for him. That's what the shooting was about. See, Hamura knows he's a target. And I believe he's not the only one who should be worried about himself. Do you get the picture? Huh? Keep your eyes open. I'm telling you this as a friend. Otherwise, you do you. I'm gonna do the right thing. <clears throat> Don't talk down to me! <laughs> you might as well let this mole shit go. Think this is some kind of Yakuza pissing contest, do ya? Come on! The mole is way bigger than you know. What do you mean? You know something. I can see it in your eyes. Hamura trusts you. Now tell me the damn truth! What about stopping the mole? You willing to take responsibility for another murder? Don't talk like I owe you. Attorney-client privilege. Not like you'd remember it. Go back to school. Shintani! Well, that's no good. I thought you said that you respected that guy, Yagami. Hello? Yo, it's me. I'm out front of the Matsugane office. Looking into the shooting? Yep. The place is absolutely swarming with cops. Kuroiwa's running the investigation. Kuroiwa? Kuroiwa? You mean Ayabe's boss? That's him. Speaking of, Ayabe's here too. Makes a convincing cop when he tries. I was actually thinking I'd invite him over to tender. Try and get my hands on that juicy police info, you know? <laughs> you mind coming along? Not at all. See you over there. Stay down. You must be making a killing with the state this city's in. Ain't that right, Ayabe? 
And it's all thanks to you. Do you know anything about the Matsugane shooting last night? Not too much, no. But hey, I thought you got Higashi for all your Matsugane needs now. Word travels fast. Who told you that? Kaito. Just now. Huh? You forget how to keep a secret, Kaito-san? Or are you trying to get your buddy killed? Higashi's screwed if Hamura finds out he's been helping us. Look, man. There's no point keeping stuff from Ayabe. Better to just tell him up front than have him find out somewhere else. What can I say? I'm a professional. Sure. Professional snitch. If the shoe fits. But sorry. I really don't have much for you today. Say what? You telling me I bought you a drink for nothing? What? Are times too tough to buy around? Here. Let me at least repay you for the booze. Go on. <laughs> Did you know Hamura's in hiding? He's been out of the office ever since last night. Not even the cops can find the guy. <sighs> yeah, Higashi told us as much, actually. You charging us for this old news? I'm starting to wonder here. Okay, okay, fine. You want answers? Go ahead and ask. Everything's on the house for tonight. I'd rather talk business than sit here in silence anyway. Sounds good to me. Let me think. How are things in the Matsugane family? Well, you already know about the shooting. Their hands are tied while the cops are running the show. So, yeah, they've been pretty quiet. Why are the Kyori and Kamurocho to begin with? What's a Kansai group doing this far from home? Because they wanted turf in Tokyo, duh. Even if it meant war with the Tojo? They couldn't have the numbers for that. True. Compared to the Tojo's 25,000, Kyore have a meager thousand at most. Plus, Kamurocho is not exactly their home turf. And by that logic, they don't stand a chance. And yet they've been here almost two years now. Crazy when you think about it. Even the cops put money on the Tojo clan, crushing them into dust. So, what's the holdup then? The Kyore has the backing of the Kajihiro group. In other words, a lot of fucking money. Kajihiro? Isn't he a construction bigwig? Yep. And one of his subsidiaries is the perfect Kyore cover. I suppose you'd know it better as KJ Art. Yeah. We're familiar. What does Kajihira have to do with the Kyore? Why is he funding Yakuza? Probably so he can expand east out of Kansai. The real money is out here anyway. From what I hear, he's got some big redevelopment plans for Tokyo. What kind of plans are we talking? Not a clue. But if they're coming from Kansai to do it, Shit's gotta be important. And there's always dirty work with those kind of jobs, you know? Like what? Evictions, land sharks, laying the political groundwork. The Kyore is handling all that shit for Kajihira. Least, that's the word on the street. Yeah, thanks. These rumors of yours are gonna do us a ton of good. Well, what I know for sure is that the Kajihira CEO's been up in Tokyo a lot lately. Schmoozing with politicians, government officials, even Kazumi, the head of the Ministry of Health. Why would a construction guy be talking to someone from the Health Ministry? What's the connection? Beats me. Point is, the Kyore aren't here just for Yakuza shit. It's way more complicated than that. How's Kamurocho seem to you lately? Tense. And that shooting only made things worse. Nobody knows when the next fight will break out, or where a stray bullet might end up. Right. And our killer's only gone for Yakuza so far, but he could target anyone next. Gunfights? A murderer on the loose? This city's a mess. <laughs> you got that right. By the way, Amura might have walked, 
but the cops are still pretty fixated on this mole case. Even the public's wondering who will be next. Huh. All right, I gotta go. Already? You're a busy boy. Yeah. Kaito-san? Huh? Yagami and Kaito, yes? What an honor. Tokyo Police. The name's Kuroiwa. Kuroiwa. The one who almost put Hamura behind bars. Before you two pulled him out of my grasp. Huh. <laughs> so what? <laughs> I've become a department punchline now. I have you to thank. Hmm, you're very welcome. And I see you're here too, <laughs> Ayabe. Oh, Kuroiwa-san. Nice nights. It's great to see you. Yeah. I cut out of work to grab a few drinks. You doing the same, Ayabe? Nah. <laughs> Old me? I don't play hooky. Well, we should be on our way. Hey. Let me ask before you go. The Okubo case. You let that murderer get off scot-free. After which he burned his poor girlfriend to death. And yet, here we are with another murderer roaming the streets of this city. I wonder who the next victim will be. You consider that. Yagami Sensei. You good talk? Yeah, I'm used to dealing with assholes like that. What was Kuroiwa doing there anyway? I bet he knows about Ayabi's little side gig. Probably came to keep him from chirping too much. Right. Or maybe he wanted to keep an eye on us. Hope not. I don't need that guy breathing down our necks. Anyway, you want to head home? Not yet. Something's bugging me about the Kyore clan. What do you mean? Until today, I just thought they were here scouting out some new turf in Kamurocho. But it turns out they've got a construction conglomerate behind them, and they're involved in redevelopment, too. So you want to figure out who the real Kyorei is? Not a bad idea. But how are we going to investigate? You don't remember? We have a friend on the inside. <laughs> you mean Murase? Oh yeah. Come on, let's head to KJR. Hey, Talk, we're getting close to KJR. Hey.